morning, my savvy real estate investors. So this has been a little bit since I've uh, come live in the group. You know, I apologize. I went on vacation right before um, last week. And as you've seen, I've been posting in the group each night a live stream that we are doing called Leading Through Change, Leading Through Change every night at 9 p.m. Central Time, where I've got a bunch of industry business leaders, um, big time real estate people, mega agents, real estate investors from all around the country that are on there sharing information on how to thrive during times like this. Um, so every night, 9 p.m., leading through change, um, there's, there's, there's millionaires on there, super successful people that are on there just opening the book who, be, who want you to be successful. And so today I wanted to come to you and say, don't let these crazy times keep you down. And, and what I mean by that is right now, today, especially a lot of people are adjusting to a new normal. There are shelter in place and orders uh, safer at home is what we call it back in Wisconsin where I'm from, which is kind of a crazy name. And people are trying to figure out what they need to do. And you as real estate agents, real estate investors, real estate professionals need to be able to look forward and figure out how it is that you can stimulate your database, how you can generate income right now while you're sitting at home. And so obviously there is an end in sight for all of this. You know, ideally in most places, you know, we'll be getting out of our houses here in the next couple of days. And the thing that I want to share with you guys is what are you doing to fill your funnel for the time that you are now able to go back and walk properties. You are now able to go and show and, and show your listings, put your listings on the market. You know, what are you doing to fill that funnel right now? People are at home and they want to talk. So now here's a little pro tip when you're doing these things. So as you're reaching out to your database, the biggest thing to do is not to ask them if they want to buy or sell. Now is not the time to go to people and asking for them or asking them to do things for you. Call them, engage them, see if they need help with anything, be the light that they need. That's the form of lead generation you need to do right now. It seems counterintuitive, but I want you to call people within your database. I want you to call leads and ask for nothing. I want you to ask for nothing. I want you to be that person that's there, that they know that you are there to help them regardless of whatever it, it may be that they need. You know what, maybe you can't help them, but you might know someone that can. In times of great stress, in times of great duress, people look to leaders, they look to people who can help them through these hard times. And you being real estate professionals, real estate investors, real estate agents, like I said, just a real estate professional, have an opportunity and have an ability to help lead people through these times because they still need to buy, they still need to sell. Distressed and motivated sellers still have that same motivation to sell their home and improve their situations in life. And so don't let these times, you know, define you. Don't let these times get you down. Don't, don't be sitting at home and thinking to yourself, there's nothing that I can do. There's, I, I'm completely, you know, devoid of opportunity and option. You know, I went live on my main page yesterday talking about lead generation. You should be lead generating like a madman, mad woman right now because there's so much you could do to set the table to be able to reap the rewards on the backside. So what, you know, call through a database, find a lead list and just start being a good human being. If you're a good human being, people are gonna remember that goodwill. They're gonna remember that good nature. So regardless of whether they're looking to buy or sell their home, after this is all said and done, they're going to remember you as the great person that reached out to them in a time of need, came to them selflessly to serve. Servant leadership right now more than ever is going to be what differentiates people and, and helps you succeed in areas that others wouldn't. Servant leadership, guys, I want you to practice that, especially as you're lead generating right now. Dario, my friend, good morning. Glad to see that you're awake. I know that you were up late with us last night um, on the Lead Through Change um, live stream. So, you know, guys, Daryl even jumped in on the live stream last night. He wasn't even a panelist, but he was like, this is powerful. I want to share some books that I'm reading. Um, it was great stuff. So I highly suggest joining that. But guys, these crazy times don't need to keep you down. They don't need to be a time to where you sit at home and you wallow and say, you know, woe is me, the sky is falling. Because right now, the playing field for a lot of people is level.
We're all stuck at home. We're all stuck in offices in our homes that look similar to mine. And we're trying to figure out what we can do to generate revenue or at least keep the ball rolling on this. I know with my team, you know, I told them this is business as usual, guys. The only difference is, is that we can't walk certain properties for two weeks down the road. So we're double down, we're doubling down on all of our lead generation efforts. We're making more phone calls. We're sending out more ringless voicemails. We're doing more outreach now than we probably have um, at any time prior to this. And honestly, it's gonna set the tone. It's gonna set the tone for when we're done with all of this. And that's the biggest thing that I can tell you guys. You know, if you have a social media platform, you know, uh, use it. Go live on your Facebook page. Be present, be a face. Right now, people are craving any form of interaction. And so if you can be this person to help them get through these hard times, they're going to remember it. Now is not the time to be selfish. Now is not the time to be selfish. You know, you're gonna hear me on my live streams talk about this all the time, that servant leadership is such a huge thing. It's going to be what allows you to make money when, you, when, you're coming, when we're coming out of this on the backside. So guys, the biggest thing I can say today is especially as, as you're adjusting to, to staying at home in many places, take a deep breath, it's gonna be okay. Kristen, it's so good to see you. I hope everything's going well for you over in uh, Baltimore. Um, I hope you're not cooped up inside, but I, I know that you're always making the best of every situation. Um, you know, guys, th these, these tough times don't need to, to define you. And what you're going to realize is as soon as you take a deep breath and you let everything calm down, that these times aren't as bad as they seem. It is a new normal. And the beautiful thing about a new normal is it is a new opportunity for you to be a better version of yourself. It's a new opportunity for you to recreate your business. It's a new opportunity for you to, you know, possibly start something new. You know, there's plenty of time now that you can pour into yourself and educate. You know, I encourage you to go back through a lot of the savvy content. Start posting more regularly in savvy, asking questions because Lord knows even I have enough time to answer more questions now than I ever did before. So start becoming a better version of yourself. Guys, Right now, accountability is at the uh, is at the highest it's ever been because you can only rely on yourself right now because we're all stuck at home. And so you have an opportunity to to make this situation into something that it was never that you could never dream of. You know, we talked about this in our lead through change live. Is that I guarantee you, I guarantee you, there are people that are stuck at home right now in the social isolation that will have changed their lives and probably never need to go back to work again because they will have set the course for a lifestyle that they never dreamt of because they seized the opportunity now. They seized the opportunity now to grow their businesses. And you do that right now by being a servant leader. As a real estate professional, as a real estate investor, as a real estate agent, reach out to your target audience. And I said, provide value. You know, call, if you're a real estate agent, call your database and just ask them, is there anything I can do to help? If you're a real estate investor, instead of calling people right now, asking if they want a cash offer on their home, ask how you can help them. Because right now they need help more than ever because they are a motivated seller. They are someone who needs to sell their home, but my Lord, right now they can't do it. So instead of being a shark in the water smelling blood, call them and provide value because you know what? There's going to be a time that they're going to be able to leave their home. There's going to be a time that they're able to go back to work and they still need to sell their home. And if you're not the one that's providing them value, that's giving them a better life, giving them a better opportunity, you're going to lose because there's going to be people like me and people watching this live stream that are going to go out there and provide tons of value and serve people and win big. I promise you guys, together we will get through this, together we will win. That's all I've got for you right now, but one thing I do highly suggest, guys, every night, 9 p.m. Central Standard Time, you see me stream it here in the group, you see me stream it on my live stream, you probably have noticed some of the other names and faces that I have on that live stream as well. It's called Lead Through Change. These guys are millionaires. They have built big businesses from the ground up. Most of us have been homeless. Most of us have been bankrupt. And we've built our businesses to what they are now. And we're opening the book. We're opening the book on our mindset. We're opening our book as to how we approach business, how we are thriving during these times. Guys, I want you to win. From the bottom of my heart, I want you to win. We want you to win on the Lead Through, Ch Lead Through Change panel. Savvy Real Estate Investors want you guys to win. Tune in every day, post in the group, guys, we can do this and we can win. That's all I've got. And hey, remember everybody,
if it don't make dollars, it don't make sense.